Welcome to another episode of Fresh Look. For Teachers Appreciation Week, we're showcasing the Teachers of the Year and the RUSD Employees of the Year. Check it out. Probably the thing that I enjoy the most about teaching is the fact that I get to teach teenagers and that I get to teach young people that are about to go into the real world. I love real world scenarios. I love that they have real questions. Not that younger people don't have real questions, but that teenagers tend to have questions that are going to be relevant um, in their whatever path it is that they choose. Um, I love when my students, uh, when the light comes on and when they get something and when they're just excited about it. Um, I love the fact that they walk in the room sometimes not sure that they're going to be successful but then uh, after being in the class for a while they're excited to come. I love the fact that a lot of my students don't miss class um, because they're not scared of the work and that they're willing to work hard. Um, I love making connections with students, um, especially in the middle school. Uh, they're, they're figuring out who they are as an adult because they're moving into that uh, transition into high school. So in the middle school you really see them becoming who they are as an individual. So I really enjoy making those connections with students. And then for most of my students it's the first real time that they get to have science every single day. So I love to teach them new things. I love to see their um, their eyes light up when they learn something new or if something has been um, you know what they've always thought was true is now not true because you know I'm teaching them something so it's I call those the light bulb moments so I love to see those light bulb moments and that's just what I love about teaching is teaching kids science getting them excited about science and making those connections um, to things all around them and then also making those connections with them. I love getting those um like this year I'm going to two graduations from college and I love to get those announcements and from the kids who didn't only um, do what they were supposed to in middle school and high school but they did what they were supposed to do in college and they gave me an um, invitation to their ceremony at college. So I'm going to Northridge graduation on May 19th this year. I, I just love to see what happens in the classroom fan out to their whole life. So UCR Sisters program, Success in Science and Technology, Engagement with Role Models, took some of the University of Heights Middle School girls out to Sycamore Canyon Park so they can experience all the wildlife and nature so they can be inspired by STEM. Check it out. to introduce the girls to the work that I do. Um, I'm a conservation biologist but I have a background in mathematics so I what I hope to do is to show these girls how important mathematics is and that they can do all kinds of really cool interesting things that they've perhaps never thought of as a career before. This is more the bio side, this is what's here, it's right in our own backyard. Just try to get them more aware and maybe get them to go into those kinds of careers because right now it's not a girl thing. It's really important that students get exposed to just ordinary people who have had a college degree because it shows them that they can do anything with their lives. <laughs> Um, well, the UCR students are very interested in promoting what uh, you know what their field is in the university, the STEM fields, and they want to reach out to the uh, you know public school students, the kids in our system, and make sure that they understand the opportunities that uh, are available to them. Oh my God! Oh my God! It's really cool. I mean, it gives them an opportunity not only to get out of class, which of course is what they enjoy, right. but I mean. For us to be able to have an impact on their life in any kind of way, that's just that's all we're hoping for. We just want to inspire them in some kind of way. Follow the math sciences, you know. Yeah. Understand that women can do whatever they want these days. Come back! Hey! Stop following you! Well, I want to be here because, but I'm scared of things. Is that a, is that a no, I don't know. Yeah, no, no, 
it's not. It's a moth. I don't know. It flies. Well, I think that it's very important to really make it an equal playing field for both males and females. And um, so that's what this program is all about, to, to let girls know and empower them that they can pursue them and they can do whatever they want to do. My name is Angela McKinney, Kelly Powell, Dr. Laurie Nelson, Lana Whitlock. Oh gosh, you make me cry. <laughs> I love working for RUSD because I, well, I've been here for 16 years. There is not a day goes by that I have to question what I'm going to do today. I always love coming to work. I thoroughly enjoy working with the people I work with, and I do. I, I'm always learning. I'm. I have learned so much over the past few years. I've learned so much over this year. Every day I learn something new. One of the things that I like best about my job is being able to build a sense of community at my school. A place where children can come and be safe and be healthy and happy and learn, but also a place where parents and families can come and join together and, and build a sense of community. I have to say that the most enjoyable part of my day is knowing that every day I get to get up and come to a place where there's wonderful kids and a great staff. Those are lifetime memories that I have every day that I come. Oh my goodness, students. Students and teachers. I love teaching and I love being with the students and, and uh, watching them learn and be successful and just how confident they feel. So that, that's an easy question. Being able to help people, um, being able to help them succeed in their careers, um, being able to put them in the right uh, positions and help them with their questions in their job. Oh gosh, many facets of it. It's, it's wonderful. I've been here for 15 years um, working in this department, Network and Information Systems, now uh, known as Technology Services, and it's just been an awesome ride. Um, I think uh, what I like most is the collaboration with uh, not only our administrators, but our district office personnel, as well as, like I said, our teachers, our students, and uh, once again, our parents. So it's really, a, it's been a great ride. Breathe a little bit. Can't deal with the pressure right now. How many takes is it gonna take? He's like, how many takes? <laughs> so UCR Sisters program, success in si success. In si <laughs> Welcome to another episode of Fresh Look. Thanks. So UCR Sisters program, si success in science and technology. Tectonics. <laughs>